So we're Carpal Diem. We are a team of two mechanical engineers, two bioengineers, and an electrical engineer. And what we're working with is we are creating a force testing device or suite of different devices in order to test 3D printed prosthetic hands. So there's a demographic of kids with congenital partial hands, and this means that they are born without fully formed hands. There's a group that's come about in the last few years called Enable. It's an online-based uh, group of volunteer 3D printers. But the issue with these hands is that a prosthetic hand is not absolutely perfect in its function as a normal hand. The kid will probably discard it. The child will probably discard it and just go back to its own adapted, his or her own adapted ways of using its, um, his or her palms before. What we have here is basically a testing system to help determine are these hands force efficient, can they do a true cylindrical or spherical grip, and how we do that is first we place the hand on our mechanical arm. And so basically this is running a motor so that you can see can the hand be gripped at 30 degrees, 40 degrees, whatever. So what you would do is you type into our GUI first what direction you want um, by just switching the toggle button and then how many degrees do you want to go. So let's say 30 degrees, and you run the program. And so with that, it's running the motor so that you can see the hand is closing around, and you would have some sort of object, such as the cylindrical censored object. And so with that, you can see when you're pressing on the different sensors, which the hand would be doing, you can see the different pressure distribution. It also is going to have a force input, which is how much pressure you have to put into the hand, and also force output. So how strong is it gripping these objects? The goal of this project is to just give more information to the prosthetics community in general. This project is so great because it's, it's working with people that are just in it for the love of helping and in it for the love of, of new technologies and what's new and exciting and how can we just understand more about the ways that um, we can be fabricating prosthetics. Back it up. Right here, right here.